Hello! That's me back from my break from making videos in the horror of Mike. Uh, I've enjoyed my little break. I know I uploaded one video, which was an older video that I'd recorded before, but yeah, I'm, I'm back now and I've got so many videos to make, so many movie reviews, pickup videos, all sorts of stuff. But the, the first thing's first, I need to get into what's been happening in terms of movie news. There's been a lot of developments with a lot of big films, big franchises since uh, I've, I've stopped making videos here and obviously the biggest one for me is Prometheus that's a film which I've talked about a great deal in other videos and there's been two developments and I'm going to make two videos about it there's been the viral video and there's also been the international trailer so first thing first things first let's talk about the viral video which was released I was really impressed with this I've seen other viral videos before and this one just really sort of blew me away. It's Guy Pearce as Peter Wayland, the head of Wayland Corporation, obviously before they become Wayland Utani, within this sort of alien franchise universe. And he is giving this speech to this huge auditorium of, of people. And he's talking about evolution he's talking about human evolution and most specifically he's talking about technological evolution he's talking about human beings as they progress through time and he, he cites loads of examples the fire and he links that to the legend of prometheus and then you've got the wheel you've got gunpowder you've got the internet you've got nuclear fusion you nanotech biotech he sort of goes on and on and on with a big list of things and he doesn't really talk about what he's doing but what he does talk about is that he wants to change the world. And there's, there's that great line in, in the, the video where he says that um, something like, you know, if you excuse me, I'd like to change the world. Um, or if you bear with me or something like that. I can't remember the exact quote. I should have I should remember the exact quote. But anyway, so he says something to that effect. And we don't see anything else. We don't really see anything else, which is about kind of the, the alien universe. What we see is... A, a, a near future this sort of auditorium doesn't quite look like something that would be around right now but the, the one thing that, the, that kind of puzzled me was I'm sure he said in the video that it's 2023 in the video so you're talking about like just over a decade away from now and I understand that maybe they're trying to link it in with the years of uh, Alien etc but it I don't know, it seems like it's too near to us now, if you know what I mean, in terms of they're going to go on, well, we know the film is going to be about an expedition somewhere to another ship. So I don't know if this is something which has taken place years and years and years before the uh, events of, of what else is going to happen in the film in terms of the, the spaceship going out to investigate this this. this planetary body but we will talk about that in the next video because the next video is about the international trailer <clears throat> guy pierce was excellent in this little video he really came across it his voice sounded exactly like sam neil he sounded like sam neil and he kind of certainly exuded that corporate entity sort of vibe and reminded me almost of for some reason i, I felt it was a kind of citizen kane little homage going on there when Citizen Kane's standing giving the, the, the speech and he's got a picture of himself behind him uh, and Citizen Kane that kind of felt a bit like that and it's a, a great way to promote your film you know giving something that it gives away nothing but you realise from what from, from listening to what they're saying that the film is going to be more of a 2001 A Space Odyssey rather than an It Terror from Beyond Space <clears throat> which Alien derived from heavily it's going to be a, a philosophical journey I think this film is going to be an exploration of our origin of our past and of where we're going in the future and just as a little viral video to promote that it was really well done Everyone did a fantastic job with it. I'm interested to know if any of that is actually going to be in the film, if it was made up of stuff that we were filming then, or whether it was filmed specifically for, um, <clears throat> specifically for sort of internet viral campaign. Part of me thinks that it's it is specifically for a viral campaign uh, because mm, 
not sure the compositing between him and the background in certain places is exactly spot on as you would expect on a, a major motion picture. But apart from that, really well done. L just left me thinking, wow, this is... You see, you see, the thing is with the Alien franchise is that with the exception of... In fact, not even with the exception, in the beginning of Aliens, the second film, Ripley's on the space station which is orbiting Earth. You get so close to this idea of Earth civilization, and <clears throat> but the whole, the 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 whole vibe, the whole impression of the Alien franchise is that it is about isolation. That it is, um, the characters are isolated. They are out in the cold, the bleakness of space, and there are monsters there. There are terrifying things in the dark. And that's the, the, the sort of feeling that you get from watching these films. Even Alien 3, when Ripley lands on, on um, the, the Fury planet with the prisoners, it's their people have been forgotten by civilization, forgotten by society, removed from society, or chosen to be separate from society in some way. And this little video blows open the idea of having something which is directly about the human race in a much bigger way than the previous films and I'm really excited about that I think it's a, a, a really um, a, a really great idea to go down that route absolutely I, th I think it's pre we're pretty sure now it's <clears throat> in the well we know it's an alien universe but you know I think it's fair to be watching it this is not an alien film specifically speaking it is an expanded universe uh, in terms of not being grounded within entirely within that first film or the, the, the following films so go and check out the viral videos down below I know you probably saw it weeks and weeks ago like I said this is me just coming back making videos so um, go check that out and uh, go and check out the forums and the website and all that good stuff below and I will see you soon in fact I'll see you right after this because I'm going to do a video about the international trailer Bye for now. Okay. <laughs> I missed the stop button. Really bye for now.